Go for Peace uh, project is really important for the Interreg Central Europe program uh, since we fund transnational cooperation and one of our priorities in the government, governance field uh, is really aiming at strengthening and improving governance structures across border to support sustainable local development. And the Go for Peace with this very specific and unique topic on focusing on World War I heritage is really uh, creating a, an opportunity for regions that long, long time ago were on opposite sides to come together and work together and build on this he common heritage for it and give it a new opportunity for uh, the development and prosperity of these regions. The lead partner of the project, the Socha Valley Development Center, and uh, with the cooperation with the Foundation uh, Walk of Peace uh, in Posochia and the other partners from Belgium, uh, France, Germany, Hungary, Italy, Poland, Romania, Slovakia, Slovenia, Ukraine, and also Austria, have been awarded uh, in a new European uh, project uh, with acronym uh, Go for Peace uh, under uh, the Interact Central Europe uh, program 2021-2027, uh, which is co-financed by European um, the Regional Development Fund. The project aims uh, are to improve the management of the, the World War I heritage for better cooperation in Central Europe, with setting up uh, the innovative transnational interactive uh, model of uh, World War I heritage management, then to establish the idea of uh, European peace route, to transfer the Slovenian-Italian experience and knowledge of cross-border development and management of uh, World War I heritage to the other cross-border areas in uh, Europe and also to uh, continue with the activities planned to put um, this heritage on the UNESCO uh, World Heritage List as France and uh, Belgium uh, did uh, last year. To analyze the existing governance model in uh, protecting and uh, valorizing World War I heritage is very important to get a first uh, survey on existing World War I uh, heritage on a European level that allows us to get a proper analysis and a proper database on how right now this uh, heritage is uh, managed, valorized and protected. And it is, this is the first very important step uh, to get uh, a new and innovative governance model. And the main reason is that uh, we have a very frag fragmented eye, the, the potentials hidden by the many institutions, covered by the self-governments, cultural institutions, public bodies and the non-government organizations. The ide idea of this project and the sense of the participation of our organization is to combine them together and to prepare some system which will be responsible for presenting the heritage of the First World War. We would like to make a, a small museum uh, in my, my, my region and uh, we would like to make a concept and uh, we can find the partners uh, from Flanders, from Italy, from, from uh, Slovenia who can help us to, uh, to make, this, uh, make this concept. It is so excited uh, we can uh, collaborate together because uh, there are a lot of partners who in their country uh, has uh, some heritage and uh, they have some experience uh, that uh, we can put in our country, for example, like uh, f during this project, for example. People that travel for remembrance, they uh, come um, really respectful to your region, they really have respect for your story and for what you are showing them. So um, it's also important for hotels and restaurants that they also know the story and that they also can uh, tell something and listen to the visitor and have a discussion or um, a dialogue about what happens in the region. 
We organized the kickoff meeting of the uh, Go for Peace uh, project partners, which took place in Kobarita from 21 to 23 May. The first day was dedicated to the introduction of uh, associate partners and uh, project partners. Then the second day uh, to the technical and also uh, uh, content rules of the implementation of the project in the framework of the Interreg uh, Central Europe program and also uh, to a detailed presentation of the activities uh, to be carried uh, uh, to be carried out with the work uh, work packages by the work packages leader. After lunch, uh, there was a guided visit to some of the World War I heritage sites on the Walk of Peace Trail, uh, like the Russian Chapel under the Versich Pass, the World War I Cemetery at Lockport Mangertam and also we visited the Cluje Forest. The day ended with an excellent dinner of local delicious. The last day project was presented uh, to a general public. Almost 90 people was attended. We were very satisfied to welcome representatives from several ministries uh, and other stakeholders uh, involved in the World War I heritage to be part of round table of the importance of uh, Go for Peace project and also the idea of European Walk of Peace route. At the same time, the participants received presentation from representative of the municipality of Gorlice from Poland, the Great War Museum of Rovereto from Italy, and also from uh, Il Flanderfit Museum from uh, Ypres, Belgium, about World War I uh, heritage, its management, and also about the opportunity offered for the economic and social development of the area. Management of cultural heritage is one of the key challenges for keeping the heritage alive, in, included in the local communities. Having partners in all these domains, having partners in different countries, having a, a common framework for uh, dialogue and cooperation is one of the probably most important outcomes of projects such as this one. We hope that partners and other participants uh, felt and feel the walk of peace and also our ambitions to build a transnational interactive model of uh, World War I heritage management and that we have prepared a good foundation of the successful uh, implementation of the project and also that we will achieve uh, our uh, deliverables and outputs uh, that we put in the project.